All right. In our last video, we showed how to. I showed how to set up the Visual Studio with um, the UDK. So there's one more step that we need to add before we start creating our game. We need to open up our C drive. Go to UDK. Open that folder. Um, then inside, um, inside of UDK game and uh, config. We're going down to the UDK engine, I believe. Open that up in a notepad and type in uh, packages. Uh, that's not good. Uh, uh, what was oh edit edit packages, and you will see down here at the very bottom. I have one that I was already doing which is a good way to show uh, what you need to do. You need to go to the very bottom of this uh, area of edit packages underneath Unreal Ed dot editor engine. Go all the way to the bottom. You'll see this one here, editor package UT game uh, content. And you'll want to make another line and you want to add your new Visual Studio directory. So as you can see inside of our UDK development SRC folder like I showed last time, um, you will see screencast here. So if you open up screencast, there's another folder called screencast. And then this is where your classes are going to be. So you're going to have to say screencast uh, slash screencast to pick up your classes and build them and I will show you that right now we're we're always going to build inside of uh, Visual Studio but I will build it in the front end to show you what I mean now that we've created that we uh, also when you edit this make sure that the UDK editor and all the UDK things are closed otherwise it will be rewritten so save it close it out you don't need these folders anymore and then we'll open up the front end here. And actually, before we, um, well, actually, it should be able to do it. Um, so let's just go ahead to scripts and compile scripts. And down here inside of our console, you see it's analyzing the engine, the core, uh, a bunch of the other packages. It's flying by. Uh, UD game takes a second and you see a bunch of warnings but that is because of uh, something irrelevant that's inside of the demo so you won't see all these warnings because uh, I'm messing around with something else all those warnings appeared but you can see here screencast that screencast release was compiled in this one now that we added it to the uh, INI file and you can see it also succeeded those warnings mean nothing uh, errors are what you need to watch out for. So that is how you set up your any file uh, to take in your new game project at the very end, or uh, uh, to take up your new game project and compile it and all of its scripts.